Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of Coding with Ado. Today we're gonna do a web connect to another Google service, which is gonna be Google Docs. Okay. So basically we're gonna connect that to Node.js and we're gonna be able to write and read over Google documents. So let's get started. So first thing we need to get our doc ID, which is this one. And the second thing is we need to have enable the Google Docs API. Okay, so we're gonna do docs here. API enable and we wait for a bit and that's done so now we need to go to credentials we're gonna create a new credential for that to Google Docs Uh, I'm gonna give you access to Oops, no. I think that uh, the complete actions. Let me see. We can try the types to go drive. Oh, okay, let's do data. Uh, let's do done here. Now we have this Google Docs. Let's edit. Go to keys. Create a key pair. Say so. Create. Perfect. And now we have the file here. Uh, which is this one. Okay. Which is going to move to our project. And then we need to go to permissions. Sorry, to, yeah, permissions. Have this mail copy, Google Docs. And we're going to work with this document. Let's say, coding with Ado test. Let's share access of edit. And share access to this uh, service account. Refresh it, share, there we go, I share to Google Docs, it's a discount, perfect, now we can play around with that, okay? So let's go to our code and let's start working. So let's do first npm init y. Let's install Google APIs. Let's create our index.js file. Now we can start coding. So the first thing that we need is to do the const Google equals to require Google APIs. We do the const about, uh, no, it's not the OAuth to play because we already have we will have the OS2 client. We're gonna do a service count, sorry. So we're gonna do we're gonna do out no out. Const out equals to new Google out. Dot Google out. We're gonna share the key file which is the Google.json and on the scopes. We're gonna add the HTTPS uh, Google APIs.com slash slash out slash docs. Okay, so now we have out, so we can start creating our functions. So the first function I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do uh, the write function. Okay, so I wanna write some something in the Google Docs. So let's do an async function, write to docs. We're gonna send the document ID, the request, 
which is the object that we need to write in there. And so let's do a my touch. Error. And let's do here conf docs equals to docs version. I think it's for Godox is v1 and the auth. And then we do await docs dot documents dot a batch update. We assign the document ID. We assign the request body. It's going to be requests. Okay. Uh, we can actually do like const writer. Go back to that and then uh, return to our writer data. So let's do an async function to write over each Google document. So let's do const writer equals to an away, write Google Docs, and let's send the Google document ID, which is the one that I'm copying right now from the Google Drive. And then the object that we need in order to write this is going to look something like this. So it's an array of objects. In the object, we're going to send insert text, the location is going to be in the index one. Okay. And the text is going to be hello coding with hello fans. Okay. And this is like an enter. Um, line break there, sending that, we have the object array, etc. Okay, so let's do console of the writer. Let's see how it looks like. No index. So let's not define requests. I think it's request. Okay. Here's the permissions, okay. And let me see what we're missing here. Um, okay, yeah, the problem is that this has to be documents. Let's see again. Okay, is the better receive or no name request? So it means that this is not correct. Request body. Wait, I don't know how to. Ah, okay, yeah. Um, this is wrong. Give me a second. Because it's not. Yeah, it was before correct. It was requests. It was an array. Okay, cool. Now we have 200. So let's see if the file is actually it was actually written so let's see that yeah hello coding all fans so you know that this is not hard coded let me write something here let's run it again and you can see how it appended that so let me move that too let's do that again and again and again so that's awesome so now how do we uh, do the other, the other way? Like, how do we ra read this information? Okay. So in order to do that, we're gonna do something different. So to read the file, what we need to do is the following thing. So let's create our function here in the async function read Google Docs. Okay, we're gonna send the document ID. We're gonna do a try catch. Console error, error, error. And in here we're gonna do the same thing. Const docs equals to Google docs 
a version p1 off and then what we're gonna do is gonna do uh const data equal to docs dot documents dot get document id actually this is a response and the response of data response and then return response dot data oh well, yeah actually wait yeah so we await that get and then return response of data and basically now we can do const data equals to await with google docs same sheet id console log data so we clear this out let's run that and we have the data here so we actually want to see the content right so let's do data dot body content so now we see the start and end for each paragraph okay so yeah basically you have to go deeper and deeper and deeper and then you will see that so let's for example try to get these elements okay so let's do dot map D, D, dot paragraph dot elements let's see if we can actually get that let me see that and you have the text run there as well so yeah basically you have you can go back and back and back like for example here zero and then do a zero text run and Yeah, I'm trying to actually get this information. Uh, yeah, there it is. So the resultado, one, two, three, four, all these contents, and then the fans two and everything. And everything we have in the middle is like the paragraph, it's because it's like a, it's a P, you know, in HTML. Uh, or you know in, in a text document or uh, editor but yeah basically that's how you write and read in Node.js for google docs so if you have any questions or comments let me know please like subscribe and everything and see you on the next episode bye bye